Welcome to the inaugural episode of Sport or Not. I'm your host, Sam Wilson. Today we have four members of the Franklin College Grizzlies baseball team. They will be competing in a few rounds of baseball-related trivia. But before we can get to the questions, we need to bring out the contestants. First, he bats left and pitches righty. And he's hoping his answers today will also be righty. It's Jackson Young. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Also competing today, hailing from Corpus Christi, Texas, it's 34-year-old UFC fighter Anthony Smith. Welcome to the show. Glad to be here. Our next contestant will be vying for the cash prize. That is a beautiful prize we bought with cash. It's Tyson Lipsky. Welcome to the show. And last but not least, well, maybe least, depending on how he answers his questions, it's Matt Early. No problem. Are you guys excited to be here? Yes, sir. Absolutely. For our first round, we'll be giving you four names of baseball players. Current or former. Playing in the MLB. You'll have to tell me which name is fake. Question one. A. Urban Shocker. B. Herbert Hoover, Mark Anthony, Tallahassee, McIntosh. C. Calvin Coolidge, Julius Caesar, Tuscahoma, McLish. Or D. Oil Can Boyd. It's which one is fake? Yeah. Do we just put the water? Yeah. Okay, you'll all turn your whiteboards around at the same time. Three, two, one. The correct answer was B. <laughs> okay, question number two. A, we have Razor Shines. B, Tim Spooniburger. C, John Pants. Or D, Wondermonds. It's gotta be Nick Babs. I've never heard of any. What was the first one? Razor Shines. Okay, turn your boards around in three, two, one. The correct answer was C, John Pants' fake. All right, last question of the round. A, Potluck Evans. B, Goose Gossage. C, Beef Bonzer. Or D, Granny Hammer. Okay, three, two, one. The correct answer was A, Potluck Evans is fake. For a second round, I will be giving them two names of AAA teams. They will be telling me which name is real. First up, Jacksonville Jumbo Shrimp or Tallahassee Tiger Sharks. Which one's real? Okay, three, two, one. Jacksonville Jumbo Shrimp are the real team. Let's go. Question number two. The Toledo Mud Hens or the Dayton Kingfishers? Three, two, one. The Toledo Mud Hens are real. Question number three. The Springfield Isotopes or the Albuquerque Isotopes? Three, two, one. Two. You want to put a three? <laughs> the Albuquerque isotopes are real. Question number four. The St. Paul Saints or the St. Petersburg Saints? Three, two, one. The St. Paul Saints are real. And for your final question of the round. Um, these, both of these locations are real, by the way. Just which team is real? Ketchup Town Cheeseburgers or the Sugarland Space Cowboys? Three, two, one. The Sugarland Space Cowboys are the real team. Let's go. Space Cowboys. Right. Sounds like Alabama. 
Whoa. You got the ball, you get an extra point. Let's <laughs> go. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Come on. Concluding round two, we'll take a quick break and have a score check. Anthony currently has five points. Matt, eight. Tyson, five. And Jackson, six. It's still anybody's game. Okay. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the final round. How well do you know your teammate? Question number one. In his first game of the season this year, Anthony recorded a double against Hope. Did he end up scoring? Oh my god. <laughs> that was a rough game. Was that the... It was like 97 to 2. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright, three, two, one. The answer is yes. Who drove you? He did score. Oh, yeah, was I, that back to the goals? Yeah, it was. Oh, Question number two. Did Jackson have more or less than 41 strikeouts in 2022? All right, three, two, one. The correct answer was less. Yes. He had 40. Ooh, that's a good line. That's a good line. Question number three. Matt had home runs against two conference teams last year. Name one of them. Getting real now, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, y'all don't pay attention. How long we get? Five. <laughs> three, two, one. Remember, I'm on base. If you said either Manchester or Bluffton, you are correct. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen. Man means Manchester, by the way. Is that what you put down? Yeah. I put Thank you for that clarification. Was that CG? <laughs> for, for our final question. Tyson Lipscomb, two-time first-team All-HCAC and third-team All-Region catcher for the Grizzlies, had only one at-bat his freshman year. What happened? Hmm. How specific do you mean to be? Like a hit or a like single, double, triple? Yeah. Three, two, one. It was a strikeout. Ah, it, was it looking? Go. It was looking, let's go. Yep. All right. Dang, I have faith in you. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for a score check. I'm not very good at counting tallies. <laughs> so, tied for third, Tyson and Jax. Thank you for playing. All right. And our winner, the first ever Sport or Not game show, Matt Early. Mm. Here's your prize. No way. No. Show it to the camera. That's fire. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you guys for playing. Make sure to watch your Franklin College Grizzlies play baseball this year. They're going to go crazy. Let's go, Grizz. Let's go, Grizz. Roll, Grizz. Roll, Grizz. <laughs> Thanks, Sam. Thank you.